Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Welcome to computational physics class. Here are the exercise questions of chapter number one of Ekman series. Question number one is to program in C++ to calculate the radius of the circle. Now let's start with the programming. In order to write a program in C++, first of all, we have to include the header file, iostream.h. In this, cout and cin commands are defined. Now, I am including another header file that is conio dot h if we want to use the command of clear screen the clear screen command is defined in this particular header file now let's start with the main function clear screen it will give the output in a new screen this command will do that First, the declaration, we have to take a variable area, a variable radius, and pi. Here you can use float also. If you are using a decimal type of integer uh, values, then you can use float also. So, area as we know area of the circle is pi r square. First, we will initialize the values. Area is equal to 34 and pi value is 3.14. While 3.14 is a floating time uh, value, so it's better to use a float over here. Okay. Now, radius. Here we are using an assignment statement. Radius is equal to area is equal to pi r square. So, square root. area divided by pi. Here square root is another command and this command is defined in a header file which is math.h. So we have to include that particular header file also. Now we will print the value of radius. By using this C out command and the return zero that will ensure the termination of the main function successfully. Now let's compile the alt f9 errors area. So here spelling mistake over there. Successfully done. Now we will run that program and we will see the result over here. You can save that program by right any name of that program. I write radius and exit from that 
particular program.